Okay. Uh, hello, we are Thonic. You are watching Songbringer. Okay, hello, you guys. How are you doing tonight? Great. Great. I think we enjoyed the show very much. Yeah. Yeah, you did. Yeah. And last week you played at Wacken. Mm. How was that? Oh, the crowd uh, were uh, very crazy, mm -hmm. and like today, so we enjoyed it very much. Was it your biggest show, the Wacken show? Uh, I uh, we play a few uh, festivals before, like Download Festival mm -hmm. and uh, and uh, Fuji Rock Festival in Japan. So. Uh, these different kind of um, uh, festivals we play before, and yeah. Wacken is very um, unique. Unique, I think. Yeah, mm -hmm. it's yeah, very unique in the so, world. Yes. Yeah. yeah. And as you are from Taiwan, I of course have to ask you, how is the metal scene there? Also, uh, it's getting bigger, I think. Yeah, it used to be very small, uh, but now most of the international metal bands play in Taiwan as well. And also, uh, after, uh, in the last decades, there are, there are more and more Taiwanese metal bands jo uh, formed. So I think it's getting bigger and it's uh, very quite close to like the Japanese scene right now. Mm -hmm. yeah. And are you the most well-known man there? I the metal so. band, yeah? Yeah, oh. definitely. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and and you as the only girl in the band, how is that for you with all the guys? Uh, it's a disaster. Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> no, it's a, it's okay. Just get used to the different habits from uh, different guys. Yeah. Uh, so um, I practiced for a few years, and now I'm getting used to it. So everything's fine now. And are the male group is too annoying for you? Uh, you, you mean another band? No, the the male group is, you know, because uh, you're the only uh, woman. I, I see. Uh, Are they too annoying? The I know. everywhere. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I I learn I I learn how to uh, deal with this kind of mm -hmm. situations. Yes. So uh, I I think uh, nowadays it's okay. It's okay. All right. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. And um, you're from Austria. Since when are you in a band? I'm not in the band, I'm a substitute for Danny, the original drummer. Okay. Yeah. How was the show for you? Yeah, it was pretty awesome, I guess. Yeah. Yeah. We worked with uh, Sebastian several times in the uh, European festivals and he did a great job. We really enjoyed to work with him. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Same for me. Cool. And you call your music Orient Metal. Mm. Could you explain that to me? It's more like because we all listen to Taiwanese music when we are during our growing up. So it's like it, our root. So we just, it's just very natural for us to write metal with the Taiwanese root. So we, it's, we, found, out, we found out that it's not that easy to, um, to categorize our music. So it's yeah. easier to say just like Orient metal than make the world, make the metalheads have an imagination about how our music uh, sounds like. Yeah. Yeah. And when you play shows here in Europe and compared to Asia, is there a big difference like in the crowd? Mm. Yeah, the biggest difference is uh, the girls will uh, very, uh, how to say that? Mm. Open. <laughs> <laughs> yes, the guys. Could you explain <laughs> that to me? <laughs> uh, they might just. Uh, <laughs> oh, yes, yes. There That's are more, what open means. Yeah, okay. more, more female fans with uh, open minded. So, uh -huh, yes. yeah, and also the. I think the crowd are more crazy. Like uh, in Asia, because the metal scene in Asia just been started for like a decade so yeah. they are not really in uh, they more like analyzing the music sometimes so they sometimes they are not that into the music mm -hmm. but in Europe I I can see the crowd put their full energy into our music so it's just encouraging ourselves more to like to be a part of the whole scene in the yeah with the crowd with the fans yeah. All right. yeah. and which bands influences you all different for each members. Are there also European bands which oh, yeah, you yeah, I like like Emperor 
uh, I, I'm a old, old school black metal <laughs> <laughs> head, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you? Mostly thrash, mm -hmm. like mm, Testament, yeah. Me Megadeth, Slayer, Slayer, Definitely. Pantera, yeah. something. Do, will you watch Slayer or do you have to leave? No, we don't have time. Yeah, but uh, uh, we we have been uh, we enjoyed their shows a lot uh, in the uh, before uh, in other festivals. Yeah. And how could uh, your fans imagine your tour life? Is it like a lot of party? Used to be. Used to be. Past ten. Yeah, used to be. It's past ten already. All right. Uh, we, 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 it's more we, like nerd, nerd lives nerd, of nerds. nerds. Yeah, a lot Asian of Asian nerds. nerds. <laughs> <laughs> use computers a lot. Uh, and, yeah, yes. after the show and stay calm and use computers, work, working, working. But yeah, we try to get more into the the Western way of touring. Yeah. 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 So yeah. some Western bands already ask you, do you want to drink with me a little? Yeah, mostly Finnish bands. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we drink. We have drank a lot. You shouldn't drink with them. That's no, that's where the hard. No, we we lose the battles all the time. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and and you won actually the the gold medal award, oh, right? Oh, Is really? Oh yeah, 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 in Taiwan, yeah. Oh yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's like the Grammy award. I yeah, I read. Yeah. Did you expect to win that? How was it yeah. to win that? Uh. N no, but uh, it's it's not that important things for for the band, I think, because mm -hmm. oh, it's yeah, okay. very. Um, uh, I, think I think it's more like we didn't expect the judges understand metal at all. So okay. it's more like encouraging us that oh, the metal scene in oh, Taiwan yeah. is getting bigger. Even the judges of uh, pop music awards they understand m metal. So it's not like we feel like we are big in Taiwan now, but it's more like. Uh, encouraging thing that oh the scene getting different getting bigger yeah and um, your face painting does it have a special meaning for you yeah you should ask Sebastian it's just it's just we, we try to get all the different elements from the Taiwanese local culture yeah, yeah because we got the uh, face paints uh, the Aboriginal ways and also the Taoism uh, culture. Oh, so we yeah. try to get some elements like the marks uh, of his forehead, her forehead, mm -hmm. and all different kinds of marks. Yeah. yeah. So we try cool. to, yeah, that's that's our rules as well. Yeah, so, right. yeah. so this is already my last question. What are your plans for this year? Uh, after this show, we'll fly back to Taiwan, and after a few days, we'll fly to uh, we'll fly to Japan for. For the biggest festival in Japan, it's called Summer uh, Sonic. Very cool. Yeah, so uh, we so are. So a lot of touring. Yes. Mm. Yeah? Yes. Thank you for the interview. Thank you. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you. Thank See you in Austria. <laughs> Austria. Sorry. Thank you. <laughs>